Dr. Aaron Thompson was at Big Sandy Community and Technical College this morning to have a roundtable discussion about progress made toward finding employment and workforce developments in the area. Dr. Aaron Thompson, president of the Kentucky Council on Post-Secondary Education, was in Prestonsburg on Thursday to lead a workforce roundtable to help recovering addicts find careers. The great thing about this, it really takes the students where they're at with their histories and put them in and allow, allows them to use that history and that knowledge along with what we give them to be able to be of assistance to others. So this opens up that. We op it opens up peer specialists. It opens up a variety of other career ladders toward behavioral health. We're, as a matter of fact, we're connecting this with other associate degrees in behavioral and mental health. And we're also associating this with a move on to a bachelor's degree in social work and then on to a master's degree in social work. So it opens up a huge territory of opportunities in behavioral and mental health. Do you worry about having enough money to last throughout retirement? Give Reed Potter at Raymond James a call. Reed has 26 years experience helping folks enjoy their best life in their retirement years. Many attending shared their stories of survival and hardship in order to have a chance at education, a sentiment Johnson said he can absolutely relate to. I'm a poor kid from Eastern Kentucky, from Clay County. Uh, I was born in a holler. My father had no education, couldn't read nor write. Mother had an eighth grade education. We were sharecroppers and he worked in the coal mines. Uh, and so I grew up with eight brothers and sisters uh, in a very impoverished area and I'm a first generation high school student and then moved on obviously to be a first generation college student. What I know is that when you're coming from a particular place like that it takes a whole lot of work. There were a few certifications given out today by Dr. Thompson for folks to continue as peer support specialists and maybe beyond. He can see he says folks getting bachelors and masters through all this. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Sheldon Lee Compton.